Hey everyone, my name's Eleanor McCarthy and I'm your postgraduate officer at Newcastle University Students' Union and I studied a Masters in Arts, Business and Creativity at Newcastle University. So my role is an elected Sir Bacall Officer position and I represent all taught and research postgraduate students at the University. I attend meetings with senior staff to feedback student voice. We run campaigns like I run a week of postgraduate events um, and generally just um, try and make sure that postgrads um, have the best experience they can while they study at Newcastle and I think probably the best part of my role is just meeting students um, and getting to do really fun activities and organise events for them. So the Students' Union has loads of support on offer that all postgraduate students can access and I know sometimes it can seem like the Students' Union is an undergraduate's place but we really want to emphasise that there's loads you can get involved with and we are absolutely to here to support all postgraduate students. So on our website we have a centralised resource called the PG Hub um, where postgrads can be signposted to a variety of things. For example, we have a student advice centre um, within the Students' Union who can help you on issues such as finding housing, um, financial issues, any academic issues um, and they're specialist advisors so they can be really helpful um, particularly for postgrads who are new to the city. We also have a PG society, um, which all postgraduates can join and they run regular events and are a great way for you to get involved with the postgraduate community. And through our Give It A Go programme, we have loads of events that are postgrad recommended that I often go on as well. Um, and like I say, it's a great chance to, to meet other postgrads um, and make friends. I think what motivated me to study at postgraduate level was that the undergrad I did, I absolutely loved, but it was really practical. Um, so I really wanted that more sort of academic experience, get into really research um, an area that I was passionate about. Outside of the Student Union, there's definitely a great postgraduate community on campus. When I did my master's, unfortunately, it was in lockdown, so it was entirely online. Um, but I still got to meet people virtually and I've met up with them all in real life since, um, which has been really nice. And this year, although I haven't been studying, I've really seen, you know, as the campus has come back to life, the, the really vibrant community that we have. I think the highlights of studying at a postgraduate level for me was definitely our graduation. It was the first time I had been on campus, um, not in this role, just as a student. Um, and it was great to finally meet our lecturers, to meet the people that I'd studied with and just to celebrate everything we'd achieved in such a hard year for everyone. So that was really fantastic. And alongside that, of course, completing my dissertation and um, completing my dissertation at the same time as, as all of my friends on my course. And I think that was fantastic. Like it's such an achievement um, and it was really nice to all kind of go through that experience together. In terms of the city as well, I absolutely love Newcastle. I've been a student and lived in Newcastle for five years now and I love it and I'm hopeful I can stay here indefinitely. Um, it's just a really vibrant city. There's absolutely loads going on. There's fantastic bars and nightlife, but there's also fantastic day activities. There's beautiful areas like the quayside um, and the coast. Um, and I think with the amount of students that are in Newcastle as well, it just feels like a really strong student community and like you're, you're really part of a student city, which is lovely. And finally, if I had to give my top three tips for studying at postgraduate level, I would say the first one is to just be as open as you can to learn the new ways and new experiences. I think definitely on my master's, I had to adapt to new ways of thinking um, and new ways of learning, um, but I think that can be really exciting. Uh, the second one I would say is just get involved with as much as you can. I think there's so much going on at universities um, and it's great to just be involved in different things. And the last one would be to join some postgraduate groups um, so that you can meet people. Because I think sometimes it can feel harder as a postgraduate student than when you're an undergrad to like make friends and meet new people. So I think joining those groups to get that sort of sense of community is a really good way to go. So yeah, thank you for watching um, and I hope you enjoy the virtual postgraduate open day.